Good evening and welcome to Light in the Darkness. As is our custom now on Sunday evenings, we join with our fellow Christians across the land in reflection and prayer. In the days following the first Easter Sunday, the disciples of Jesus would have gone through any number of different reactions, from uncertainty and anxiety to joy and celebration, through incomprehension and fear to recognition and hope. If the cross had robbed them of his presence, the resurrection has restored his presence. Surely Jesus will continue to be with them always. The Gospel of John portrays the disciples wrestling with the dawning reality that Jesus will not continue to be physically present to them. It would seem that they are again to be left bereft and orphaned. Uncertainty and anxiety threaten once more. In response, Jesus speaks into their incomprehension and fear with the promise of the gift of the Holy Spirit. He reassures them that they are not alone and that his spiritual presence will be renewed in this world through the Spirit. Jesus, through the Spirit, continues to be with us always as the assurance of God's love for us. Let us pray. Living God, you are our creator and our maker, and the very breath of life is given as your gift. We thank you for the gift of life, and we embrace and treasure that gift. Living God, you are the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, whose presence in the world reveals your love for us. In the giving of your Son, you reveal the depths of your love. Living God, your Son embraced the cross and the depths of human suffering. We thank you that you delivered him on the day of resurrection. Living God, as you spoke to the bereft and the orphaned in days past, Speak to the bereft and the orphaned in days present. Speak to the uncertain and the anxious. Speak into the depths of our incomprehension and fear. Living God, your promise is that we will not be left alone to face the world. We thank you that through the gift of your spirit, that promise is fulfilled. Living God, be with all who sustain our common life at this time. Carers and nurses, cleaners and porters, doctors and ambulance staff, delivery drivers and posties, through their giving, our common life is sustained. Living God, as you have watched over us in the past, watch over us in the present, as once more we thank you that through Christ and by your Holy Spirit, We are not alone. Amen. Good night and God bless.